Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Sullivan, facial plastic surgeon at the Sullivan Center in Columbus, Ohio. And we're about to perform a medium depth chemical peel for Dina. Um, those of you who've been to the Sullivan Center, of course, know Dina as our master esthetician. Um, so Dina's gonna get a peel today. She's, she's usually the one doing the treatments, now she's gonna get a peel. So a medium strength depth chemical peel is going to take off the upper several layers of the skin. Um, it's a bit more aggressive, so there's a little bit more recovery time. This is a peel that takes about a week to recover. It's very predictable, always the same. Two days the skin is pink, two days the skin turns brown like a coffee brown color, and two days that skin peels off like a snake sheds its skin. So at the end of a week, pretty much you're back to normal. You can put makeup on and get back to your normal activities. The the finish that comes from this um, trichlorcetic acid chemical peel is wonderful. It's probably one of the, the nicest things that I do to the skin. I know Dina does a lot of treatments as well that give a nice finish to the skin, but I love the mm -hmm. way the skin looks after TCA peel, and that result will last for about a year and a half. So we have a lot of people come by every year and a half to two years and get their trichlorcetic acid chemical peel. So we're gonna go ahead and get started. Dina has already prepped her skin. Um, and so my job is just to apply the peel, um, which I'm going to do, and I, I start in sections, so I'll do the forehead first, um, and what I'm doing is, is just applying a, um, just a light film to the top of the skin here. Um, what's going to happen is this is going to coagulate the protein in the skin, and so usually what happens is we get some frosting. Uh, so if you've ever seen the movie um, uh, Mrs. Doubtfire, um, that's exactly what Dina's going to look like um, uh, after our, this peel has sat for a few minutes. It's, the skin starts to turn a frosty white that lasts for maybe about um, 20 minutes and then starts to get a little bit pink. And that frosting effect is actually um, from the protein coagulating. How are you feeling? Ooh. A little warm? A little tingle. Okay. So we're going to put a little um, cold ice pads on here and um, take away that tingle. Dina had a little uh, topical anesthetic on uh, for a little bit beforehand. That's generally all patients need. Um, and once I've placed these cold pads on the skin, pretty much relieves that discomfort in a matter of uh, minutes. That feeling better? Oh yeah. Okay. Totally fine. So we can move on. Sure. Okay. <laughs> so this peel takes me, you know, usually about oh, ten minutes or so to apply. Um, afterwards, we put on some uh, one percent hydrocortisone and then follow that up with Aquaphor for the next week, just to keep that skin. Uh, keep an occlusive seal on that skin so it keeps the moisture in because what happens is this peel sucks the moisture out of the skin and we want to keep it moisturized. And if you do that, then this will go through that natural peeling process and a week later, um, her skin will be just mildly pink and um, be ready for some makeup and ready for the holidays. We're going to go around the mouth here. Um, go ahead and stiffen your lip there. I don't need that on the forehead anymore, it's fine. Okay. Forehead's doing fine? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, so I'll go ahead and put some cold on. Now you can see the forehead is kind of frosty white. Um, and that frosty white goes away in about 20 minutes. And we'll put a little bit of cold on the cheek areas and the lip areas here. And that, that little bit of stingy feeling, people describe it as more of a sunburny feeling that lasts, uh, again, uh, just a few minutes until the cold compresses have relieved it. Um, and then it doesn't return. So there's really no pain or discomfort afterwards. You look like Hannibal Lecter. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. 
All right, so we're going to do that for the rest of the skin. Um, as I said, when she leaves, she'll be frosty white for about 20 minutes. We're going to apply some 1% hydrocortisone and, and then keeping Aquaphor on for the next week. And we'll give you updates um, throughout the week as to the progress that Dina's making. So thanks for tuning in. Um, if you have further questions about the trichlorocetic acid chemical peel, we call it a TCA peel, or any of the, the um, uh, resurfacing uh, services that we provide at the Sullivan Center, please call us at 614-436-8888. Thank you.